Hey guys, so today's Silhouette Sunday video is starting off a little bit different because I'm actually at my desk as opposed to on my computer at the Silhouette software. And it's just because I have a few products that I wanna show you and I'm answering a question from a fellow crafter this week. She basically um, wants to know what is cut by line color. I'll put her email on the screen so you have a better idea of what she's referring to or why she wants to do this. But essentially she purchased a cutting file from, an, from a designer or independent seller on Etsy or something. I believe she said it was Etsy. And what happened is she was told that she needed to cut by line color because that design she's using utilizes cut lines and it utilizes um, glitter sketch pens in the design that she saw. And right now what she's trying to do is drag away pieces of the, de of the design and cut it and then drag those pieces back and it's just not working for her. Now, for those of you who are new to Silhouette or you don't know, you can write in lieu of cutting with your Silhouette and there are a few products that Silhouette makes and some third parties also make and I'll link to them down below in the description box. But the first one or the two main ones actually, I should say, are actual sketch pens that you load into your silhouette and they look like this. I've done some videos on these in the past where you load this in place of your blade and you can write. And what she said she purchased was actually the pen holder which looks like this. And again I'll link to these products down below. Um, and what she's trying to do for her specific uh, project is she wants to use glitter pens. She wants to use the pen holder, which comes in a set of three like this. This is the new style with glitter pens. So what she needs to do is cut by line color. So I'm gonna switch over to the computer screen and show you what they're referring to when they say cut by line color. Okay, so as you guys can see, I have Silhouette Studio open and loaded on my screen and I have six very colorful lines. Now in order to cut by color what you'll need to do is actually change your lines of your cut file to different colors and to do that you'll select the image in my case it's just a line and you'll go up to the right hand corner and select the line color menu and from here you can change the selected images color to anything you want now we're accustomed to seeing red in silhouette studio but it actually could be any color you choose for it to be after you've changed your image to the colors that you need the file to be what you're gonna do is actually cut my line color, and this is Jennifer's specific question. If you go up to the top right hand corner to the cut settings menu, you actually see you have two options underneath cut mode. And to cut by color, you'll need to go to the advanced menu. Now you have one that says layer, you have an option that says line color, and you have one that says fill by color. You'll select the one that says cut my line color and this will give you the option to choose which things will cut when you click send to silhouette. So in this image we can see or in this menu, excuse me, you can see that we have red and orange selected and there's currently a cut line that you can see through the red and the orange. So if I click to send to silhouette, these are the only two images that would cut. And you can do this for each of the colors. You can either do all of them or you can do them singly. Now, each time you select a color, you'll see the line appear. You can send it to Silhouette and then you can swap out the blade as necessary. So that's how you cut by line color. I hope you guys found this video helpful. If you have any questions, leave them for me down in the comment section below. And as always, thanks for watching.